This clip is brought to you by SaveWithConrad.com. Man. Mm, look at this. How do you not love a hot start with the Midnight Express? How about those uh, those jackets? First time I think we've seen those, right? Yeah, it is. Yeah. We've even you know, commented how in the past they didn't necessarily look like a team. Right, they do right. right now. All right. How about the the fact that, oh, here we go, Bobby. Let's see if he brings him over to the set. Of course. <laughs> brings him over to Bubba and Cornette. <laughs> You know what's sad about that interview? What? You couldn't, you, Jim Cornette could not say today, crippled more yeah. people and polio arthritis. Not that. You, isn't that, isn't that just fucked up? I mean, really, I, 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 I try to be as best I can politically correct, but I'm older and sometimes you got to stop and think about what you say, but isn't that fucked up? You can't say it because you may offend someone who has polio, who had polio, which no one has anymore. I don't think. And, uh, arthritis, Jesus, that's, that's fucked up Conrad. Yeah. That that's, that's fucked up. God, I'm so glad I'm old. Another five years. You guys, I'll be gone. You guys can have this place. You won't be dead in five years. Yes, I will be <laughs> on Tony trying to uh -huh. introduce, uh, you know, Roman Reigns, now that he's on AEW. Go, go, go. Yeah. Now, don't, you shouldn't say that. <laughs> <laughs> and now, fucking rumors hit the internet. No. Hey, Conrad Thompson said that Roman Reigns is going to fuck. I was, I didn't say Adam Cole. Okay. Mm, I said, yeah. I said Roman Reigns. That's clearly okay. hyperbole. Right. right. It's not real. Yeah. Just trying to predict the future. Well, yeah, well, we're on uh if it is Adam Cole, my run's over. Oh yeah, you're 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 <laughs> done with all that side business you've had. Then it's time just gonna wrestle the whole match in his goddamn jacket. Yes, <laughs> yes. This is tremendous. Right. He didn't take his bandana off his neck. He didn't even take his jacket off. No, man. I hope he doesn't. Don't take it off now. No, he, he just pulled it out. You know what? That's Dennis Con that's Dennis Dennis Condry saying, fuck you. Yeah, I ain't gonna take my jacket off. Whoop your <laughs> exactly ass. Exactly right. I will appear as wearing a jacket. Yeah. Uh, gosh. Yeah. Here he is. Jacket bandana is still, still on. Yeah. <laughs> uh, to me, it's almost <clears throat> seems to be that he didn't like those jackets. So that was his way of saying, fuck you. I'll yeah. wear it. I'll wear it the whole time. Dennis was his own man. Hey, we don't say enough about the Mulkies either. Put them over, Tony. Put them over. Yeah. yeah uh, I'm not so sure when the famous Mulkey win came about. I don't know if it was 85 or 86. It was one of the two years. Obviously, we haven't seen it yet. It may have been 85 when the Mulkeys won their match. Hope it's 86. Hope I'd love to be able to see it because that's a big moment. That's a, that's a moment that a lot of people still bring up, you know, when the, they, the, the Mulkeys who used to take a great ass kicking and fans knew that, uh, do you see that kid running the camera? How about that? Yeah, that, that there, there, what there's, there you go. You see, I, I saw all this and I knew that Turner broadcasting back then allowed just, they, they would just pick people not out of the stands, but they would just let people learn how to run a, a camera doing wrestling. And I would think, fuck. What are we doing? I mean, we're just like, for instance, famous punter in NFL history. I don't know if you remember Rick Roby. Yeah, of course. He ran camera one time. He was a guest in the studio and they had him run camera. That just wasn't right, man. I just, that's one of the reasons. I that, think you mean Reggie Roby. By Reggie the Roby. Yes. The, Reggie Dol Roby. the Dolphins character. The Dolphins punter. Right. Reggie yeah. Roby. He was there. He ran camera. I love that double team move. Oh, uh, Dennis did take off the. The jacket, by the way, he got overheated, but the bandana stays. Boy, the monkeys could take some bumps, man. Oh God. I can't imagine falling on my tailbone on the concrete. Right? I know. I know. And he's not done. No, but now Bubba's going to whoop his ass a little. Yeah. Bit. <laughs> yeah. Cause they're, they're starting to heat things up with du you, dusty you and Bubba. See the evolution. You know, he was an enhancement guy on this show a few months ago. We watched uh -huh. it together. Right. 
his debut on the show as an enhancement guy. And now he's part of the midnight express and Uh immediately programmed with one of the biggest stars in the history of wrestling, dusty Rhodes. Uh huh. Pretty remarkable. Let's track it here. He's up on that second row. Comes up. Oh. Not much left of Randy Monkey. I can tell you that. I don't know that I would want Big Bubba to jump off the second row for me. I think it was the first time we saw Big Bubba actually roll into the ring and do something. Yeah. Yeah. He, it, Since he it, was a job guy. Oh. Uh, oh, well, they're checking on him. Let's listen. You okay. Right? Hey, hey, it's Conrad Thompson. Thanks for checking out the podcast here on YouTube. Be sure to hit the subscribe button and the notifications bell so you get a notice anytime we upload some new content. And go save yourself some money right now. If you're in a 30-year loan or you have credit card debt, it's not a matter of if I can save you money. It's a matter of how much. Find out right now for free at SaveWithConrad.com.